Finally, the African record holder Fadina Domanyala will be traveling to Oregon State at 6 p.m. East African time. Omanyala received his visa around midday today. But first, consider liking the video and subscribe to the channel, for it does help a lot. Just moments before receiving his US visa, Omanyala was polishing on his craft at the Moy International Sports Center, Kasarani. He was clearly focused and in very high moods, considering he had not received the US visa and the 100 meters World Championship begins tomorrow. I had a small talk with Ferdinand and this is what he had to say about the event. World Championships Oregon, what's uh, the winning time? What's your prediction? Whoever's going to take it, what's the winning time? Um, uh, I'll win it. I guess uh, if I run 9.6, I'll win it. But if someone runs faster than 9.6, then I think he'll win it. I like it. <laughs> According to Michael Johnson, the former 400 and 200 meters world record holder on his Twitter, he said, and I quote, I'm hearing many athletes unable to get to the US due to visa issues. I'm sure we'll find out in the coming days the extent of the issue. But if it's true, damn. Fanina Domondi, a senior reporter at BBC Africa, tweeted that Omanyala has received his US visa. Now it's a race to make it to the race in Oregon. Dr. Ezekiel Mutua tweeted, a sportsman like Omanyala should be treated like a diplomat and accorded such honor. He cannot be stranded in a visa matter like a commoner. And also sports journalist Michael Kinney, who also had an interview with him, tweeted he will arrive 2 hours and 40 minutes just before the race. According to the schedule, the race starts exactly at 12.30 p.m. Yep. Move, 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 move. That means if all goes well, during the trip, Omanyala will arrive at 9.50 a.m. That's enough time to warm up for a race. But despite the decent disadvantages he's faced the past one week, considering the jet lag and change in time zones, plus the weather, we can only hope the African king will prevail in this battle of the world champions. That's all, folks. See you in Oregon at the World Championship Games 2022. Till then... Peace.